Assalamu alaikum and welcome to Yogi Yoga. My name is Muhammad Ali and this is your place for yoga, stories and fun. It's easy, just copy the moves that I do and enjoy the adventure. We always start by sitting our bottoms, crossing our legs and taking both our hands onto our heart and saying our secret yoga code word, which is Bismillah. We always start with Bismillah with any action that we do by remembering Allah. So on three, one, two, three. Bismillah. Can anyone guess where we are today? How about we look through our binoculars? We make our hands into crab claws, place them on our face and look around. Wow, I think you guessed it by now. That's right, we're in the Amazon rainforest, the biggest rainforest in the world. Before we start exploring, let's warm up our bodies and loosen up our muscles. So, let's start with our right shoulder. We lift it up and back down and up again and down. And with our left shoulder, up, down, up and down. Do you think we can make small circles with our shoulders? Let's start going backwards with our right shoulder. One circle and two. And with our left shoulder, rolling it back and another circle. Now let's do the same thing but going forwards with our right shoulder. Make one little circle and a second circle. And with our left shoulder, one and two. Now let's shake them up and down. All right, now that our shoulders are warmed up, let's do the same thing with our necks. We start by looking over our right shoulder. Gaze deep into the forest. And then our left shoulder. Look into the woods and try to spot all the different kinds of animals. Now we look down at the forest floor. Look right between your legs and make sure you're stretching your neck. Now we look up into the sky. By night we see stars and by day we see clouds. Now let's get started and let's start our adventure. So we start our adventure by tiptoeing through the Amazon rainforest. We don't want to wake up those animals and disturb those little insects and every time we step onto the leaves it makes a little rustling noise and that's what we want to avoid so we don't disturb them and we want to avoid the big logs take big tiptoes over the log and over again and walk deep deep into the woods and on our way we see tall trees let's together make a really tall tree what we do we stand on both our feet raise one of your legs lean it against the other and put your arms above your head as tall as you can and breathe in breathe out and again breathe in and breathe out let's do the same thing with the opposite leg raise your leg lean it against the other leg make sure it's firm on the ground raise your hands above your head and breathe in breathe out this time we're gonna go as tall as we can so as far as you can reach breathe in and breathe out and relax. Now, tall trees aren't the only things you find in Amazon rainforest. You also find small shrugs or bushes. So let's make a little bush. So we'll sit on our knees and cuddle ourselves up, down, put your body against your knees and huddle. Now, we're going to breathe in and breathe out. And one more time, breathe in and breathe out. Now, on the trees you notice one of my favorite animals, or the prettiest ones in the Amazon rainforest, or the different kinds of parrots. My favorite one is the red parrot. Hello, little butterfly. So let's make a red parrot. Parrots sit on trees, bending their legs, just like this. Now we pretend to be a parrot with our wings. And every time we inhale, we're gonna lift our wings up and exhale, we're gonna lift them down. So let's do it together. like a little parrot. Did you know that the fastest animal in the Amazon rainforest is the cheetah and it goes up to 70 miles an hour. So now let's go into our cheetah position. We start off in a, almost like a push-up position, lay our palms on the floor using our tiptoes and then take one leg and lift it above the ground. If you find it difficult, 
you can rest on the ground. And here, we gotta breathe in and breathe out. If you wanna make it more difficult, just like a cheetah, back to pounce, breathe in, breathe out. Let's do the same thing with our other leg. On our tiptoes, lift it up, and I want you to make your cheetah noise. All right, breathe in, and breathe out. Breathe in one more time, and breathe out. I would love to be able to run as fast as a cheetah. Another really cool animal that we find in the Amazon rainforest are snakes, and they come in all sorts of different colors and shapes and sizes. Sometimes they're even poisonous. Shall we go into our snake position? We lie down on our stomachs, like so, <laughs> and then point our tiptoes outwards and lift our bodies up. Stretch your back and use your elbows, or if you can do it even further, try to stretch your back even more and keep your arms straight. And look straight, breathe in and breathe out. Just like a snake, a slithering snake. Breathe in, inhale into your chest and exhale. Let's do it a third time. Now, as we move closer towards the water, we find big scary rhinos. Now rhinos, they look quite lazy, but in reality, they're really, really strong. Shall we make a rhino pose? Rhinos have a big horn, so what we're gonna do for that we're going to start off on our fours with one of our legs, kick it back and take the opposing arm and lift it forward and balance. Now, as a rhino, let's breathe in and breathe out. Now, I want you to make your mean rhino face. Grrr. Breathe in and breathe out. Now, let's do the same thing with the opposing arms and legs. Bring them back in. Lift your leg up, kick it back, and lift your other arm up, balance. And now like a rhino, breathe in, breathe out. With that mean face, breathe in and breathe out. And bring your arms back into your body. And lastly, once we reach the water, we find the scariest alligators. Alligators, just like the rhinos, they look really lazy, but they're deadly. Let's go into alligator position by lying down once again on our stomachs. On our stomachs, your arms straight, lift your head up a little bit and breathe in and breathe out. Once again, breathe in, breathe out. This may not look so scary, but I think alligators are. Last but not least, we're gonna meditate. Let's go back and sit on our bottoms, crossing our feet, and think about the blessings of Allah. So today's word of the day is al muqit It means the nourisher. Think about the Amazon rainforest. Close your eyes and imagine that you're in the real rainforest. And think about how Allah has nourished us and the animals, the way the ecosystem operates, how different animals interact with each other, and survive of the nature. And think about how the Amazon rainforest is a source of food for us by providing us with oxygen and amazing, beautiful trees and forests. So next time, when you want to think about the blessings that Allah has nourished us with, say, Al-Muqeed. See you next time, inshallah.